Now just right before you get into the video, make sure to hit that subscribe button and turn the notifications bell on. And without further ado, let's get into the video, shall we? Yo, what's up ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, and welcome back to another video. Today, we're gonna be reacting to this Pixel Echo. So, yeah, some of you wanted to react me to Pixel Echo, some of you wanted me to react to God Hall, so I'm gonna react to both of them. Rex is getting removed from my list because no one really wants to me to react to her channel. So this is the situation when he had with Aziz. Alright, so yeah, I'm in the community post section right now. His community posts, as you can see, they are quite okay. He does a community post from time to time. Uh, you can currently trade 150 pixel pass tickets for a super chest. Is this worth it or not? Definitely not. <laughs> Alright, do not buy a super chest. Do not waste your pixel tickets for this super chest. That's probably not even gonna get you anything at the end. Well, it could like a bomber cat or you know, laser cat rifle, but it's probably not worth it. Bro, this is a whole uh, yeah, essay he wrote right there because he had problems with Aziz right there. He's now basically, Aziz is now a Minecraft content creator, which is okay, I guess. At least he doesn't steal promo codes anymore from other YouTubers such as Jrod, Pixel Echo, and doesn't impersonate them. And he also impersonated Hermes and all that stuff. He also probably once uh, or twice or multiple times stole Hermes code without me even knowing it. So yeah, without further ado, I'm gonna react to this video. So yeah. Let's get into it, shall we? Brand new update for Pixel Gun 3D. This is the 22.5.4 update. It's available on Android and it's coming to iOS very, very soon. Let's check it out. Just like the previous update, there is a download manager. This is how I look like once I will be 30 years old. LOL! You are able to pause this and continue this. Upon pausing it though, you're then able to go back to battle. OMG, I, I like, I swear to God, if I get the copyright, uh, you know, from Pixel Gun the background music, then I swear to God, I really don't want to get copyrighted. Let's check out the gadget change. It's to do with the smile mine. So instead of like throwing it around the map, you're able to stand in a specific place and it's just going to be placed at your feet. It's just going to give you a little bit more accuracy when placing it. My mine at least has uh, had a little bit of accuracy. I mean, it's still not really that, you know, better improve their accuracy, but the real gadgets that need their accuracy fix are like the gadgets like frag grenade, that atom nuclear grenade, and yeah, maybe even the combat spinner, you know. I've been shooting all kinds of objects, and I actually don't really know what is able to be destroyed but that was apparently one of the changes i thought it would have been things like vehicles it might actually be the these kind of things nope they're not generally being destroyed after a mid pixel gun you got to be a little bit more accurate when you're describing what is destructible and what is not destructible well what if there is not nothing that you can destroy yet what if you're basically just wasting your time <laughs> running around the lobby and trying to the destroy an item here is a good change that they've introduced if you head over to your armory and you head over to the gallery and you tap on a specific weapon let's say this and click on view there is now a button on the top right of your screen which says polygon i also quickly checked that but there is no button well when i when i you know went to the one of the weapons from the gallery i saw no button uh, you know to watch an net to, you know, because I, my developers might have already patched this, maybe, you know, I was too late for it, so maybe, I don't know, because I'm not sure if, if it's patched, uh, you know, if now you can't watch ads to try the other weapon, I don't really, I'm not really sure because I'm not playing Pixel Gun that much anymore. I think the next thing they need to introduce is a refund option. Let's say you purchase this, you didn't quite like it. Maybe you don't get all your coins back, but let's say you purchased it for 1,125. Let's say you get 1,000 coins back. I think it's better than nothing, right? That's like actually really dumb, honestly. Like, Pixel Gun 3 nowadays has 
1000 different weapons and it's not a type of game that you can sell weapons or do refunds like if you bought, bought a weapon bought, buy a weapon then you have that weapon bought you can always get back those your currency by watching free ads and playing the game and grinding and all the stuff you know so it's not uh, it's diff it's a different kind of game and no you uh, if they would do that it would be just dumb because you know like selling weapons or just doing uh, refunds if you don't like the weapon after you bought it like you can just you know that's like uh, you bought, buy a weapon then you want a refund from it that's just not how it works uh, so basically you can always grind for for it or just go to pixel country once or twice a day and collect that free currency that's even better and you will get your gems and coins back in no time overall that was going to be today for today's video and yes without further ado i will see you all soon